Rubaiyat Hussain. I'm the writer and director of Under Construction. Under Construction is basically about a middle class Muslim urban woman's journey who lives in Dhaka City and she's a theater actor and she is reinterpreting a play by Rabindranath Tagore. In Bangladesh, in the past 10 years, and the government has declared uh, film as an industry, so there are a lot of grants, a lot of subsidies from the government. Now, a lot of young filmmakers coming out and trying to make different stories that are being released mostly in urban cities, and there have been multiplexes. So even though the situation was not very good, it's turning, but it's still not turned. You know, so whoever is making film right now is struggling with their release, with distribution, uh, with getting proper people to run your production, things like that. There's no film school, so whatever people are learning, they're just learning through working on their own. <laughs> In Bangladesh, I feel very alone, you know, all the other filmmakers are men. Being a woman and directing a film, everybody's going to question you. What do you know about filmmaking? Or have you gone to a film school? Or, you know, you wrote this, you know? So it's hard to uh, be in a place where everybody else is a man and I'm a woman and I'm very conscious of myself as a, as a woman and I'm trying to tell a woman's story. So I deliberately had a lot of women in my crew. My DP was a woman, the ca camera assistant was a woman, the still photographer, two of my ADs, my costume designer, they're all women. And most of the scenes were with Roya or her mother or Moina, you know, so it's like all the women on the sets, I felt very comfortable during that. Female actors in Bangladesh get paid much less than um, male actors. I think that struggle is everywhere. In Hollywood or Bollywood, it's even worse because the rules are already set. So, you know, women get paid less, women actors get paid less, women directors get paid less, you know. But in Bangladesh, there's no structure yet. So maybe we can set different standards, you know, <laughs> who knows. When you make a film, you really want it to go out there in the world and connect with audiences. And coming from Bangladesh, where the distribution is very weak, especially for films like this, that doesn't have a lot of songs and dance and violence and fights. I want to give it my best. It's really great to start off in a place like Seattle and just also try to enjoy the fact that there are people coming to watch the film who don't know much about Bangladesh and they're going to see a piece of it through the film. <laughs> So how do we make her real? Nondini K, Nondini Kamon. Tai to amai jagi rakhoo.